Welcome back, fellas. Let's get straight to this video. The guy is a gentleman and is like nice and kind and gentlemanly. That's like, whoa, okay. <laughs> like, yes, yes, please take my hand. Yes, okay. That opens the door. Yeah. I don't know about, I don't know if that's really true, though. I feel like you guys just say that, but sometimes y'all are like, sometimes y'all girls are like, you know, he's a little too nice for me. And so I just feel like, I just feel like y'all just say that just to say it, really. I That's, feel like y'all okay, really, I will want, like, a, I feel like y'all are really attracted to, like, player dudes. What? Over <laughs> gentlemen, if I'm being honest. No. <laughs> That's not true, but I will. <laughs> it is true. But I'm explaining a little bit. I will say. I will say, I will say, I will say. Woo, I'm crying. Uh, I think what look, he... Look, look, Branson's speaking the truth. Who said that? <laughs> Who said that? See? Branton. Look at this. Branton's speaking the truth. Facts. Everybody's facts. Straight well, facts. Girl, let's let's be let's be honest. Let the girls be honest. If a guy... there, There is a difference between... There's a happy medium. Okay, okay. okay there's, there's a happy medium. There's not a boo, single... Beautiful. I'm glad that she said there's a happy medium because that's exactly who I am. So, boo, this is actually I said in the last video uh, saying that I am a rude gentleman. And what I mean as a rude gentleman is that I grew up being a nice guy. I grew up being a people pleaser. And I am big on being a gentleman. You know what I'm saying? I'm big on being a gentleman. I'm, be I'm big on being a nice guy. What I mean as this is that I'll pay for the food. When I'm out with you and I'm with romantically, I'll pay for the food. I'm not with the 50 50. I honestly, I think it's kind of awkward to pay for something and he'd be like, hey, babe, can you, uh, you know, send me Zell for half of that? I feel like that's awkward. So I, I don't I don't like going through that. So I'll just pay for everything. You know, we go go car race. I'll pay for both our tickets. I'll pay for the food. You know what I'm that's just how I am. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, so I'm a gentleman when it comes to that. I, I'll pay for the date, right? I'm a gentleman, I will open the door, I will not allow a female I'm with romantically, you know, saying open the car door or open the restaurant door. I will not let her pick up something heavy. If I'm with her, we're at Walmart and you got a, a case of water, I'm gonna pick that. I'm gonna be like, nah, you're not touching that, I'm picking that up. I'm a gentleman as I'm gonna make my female that I'm with romantically feel safe, protected, and secure. I'm a gentleman with that. But what I mean as I'm a rude gentleman is that I still have that red pill in the back of my mind as in like, I'm not gonna tolerate bullshit. I am not going to chase you. I am going to put you in your place if you try to get crazy with me. And, you know, see, I still have that red pill ideology, but I'm very big on being a gentleman, very big on being a nice guy. But I'm not a pushover, you know what I'm saying? So it's a good mix of being the gentleman, but, like, you're not going to take that bullshit, you know what I'm saying? So that's my point and my um, perspective on that. And honestly, I think that's a great mix to have is to be – a nice guy be a gentleman but you don't take bullshit i'm going to put her in a place that she ever gets out of line so it's like i'm a nice guy i'm a gentleman i'm going to make her feel protected and safe but i still have that red pill in the back of my mind like we're not going to do this shit. i'm not going to tolerate bullshit. i'm not going to tolerate disrespect i'm not going to tolerate you being toxic i'm not going to tolerate you doing some friendly shit. i'm gonna confront you and i'm gonna put you in your place that's i think that's what she means as in the happy medium is that they want someone that's going to be a gentleman because and, and, and one thing that you know nowadays people confuse gentlemen with being a simp i'm a gentleman but i'm not a simp being a simp is feeling for a female that has completely no interest in you and you're putting more into her cup than she's even thinking about you in in in, in the first place um you know some examples of being a simp is like paying for feet pics, you know what I'm saying? Send a, a shorty money that you never even talk to like that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, doing all this extra shit for females that don't even like you like that. I, I'm romantic. Like, I'll buy female flowers, buy her nice gifts, but I gotta know her for a good minute. It's not no, like, I met you for the first week type shit, and, 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 that, and that's something that turned females off. And this is why I meant as in, you know, being a rude gentleman is that, they like you being a gentleman. They like you being nice. But if you are these things quickly, first of all, there's no chase. It's like, okay, like he's mad easy. So if he's easy, that means he's easy for other females. So if he's easy for other females, that means he may not be loyal. Why is this guy so easy? There's something, there's something off about this guy. Why, why is he so easy, right? 
Uh, so that's one, two. It throws them off a little bit. They're like, like he's just trying to smash. Like they, they could be like, yeah, yeah. He's just, he's just trying to, he, he's just trying to get something out of me. He has a completely different intention. Like, why is he being so nice, so quickly, so easily? Why is he fiending? Why he trying to do this? Like, or even with like the whole "I love you" thing, right? This a lot of females that been, you know, they've been off put when it's like they hear "I love you" so quickly, so early. And, 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 and look, a lot of guys they be like "I love you," they don't even really love the female. They feel infatuated or very attracted to her, or she gave you know some type of love like, appreciation, and like you was like, man, I just like they, they they just felt something they never felt before. So now they're like "I love you," but. <sighs> Sometimes it don't really be that you love that person. You just felt infatuated or you, it's just in that moment. And um, yeah, I think that definitely is a happy medium. It's being a gentleman where you make them feel safe, secure, and protected, but also not letting them run over you. Also putting them in a place when you need to. Also not being a pushover. I think that's the happy medium right there. Um, and that's all I have to really say about that. Uh, if you don't know how many of you, if you don't have like my name, anyone that gets 50 50 financially, especially if you want to do that, I get this ticket for coming to Gentleman Boy. Use it wisely because it's your pre 100k ticket. And I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'm out. Gang.